Hi, how are you doing today? And um, it's Adrienne, and I'm back with the rosy look today. I have some uh, family stuff that I'm doing, so I'm having to, you know, dress up like a real person and do real person things. So um, I thought I'd go ahead and uh, show you what I have on and um, <clears throat> what I have on. Uh, when I was over at the Pat McGrath site, I saw that they went ahead and they have uh, this one back again. And this is the um, Rose Decadence palette. And so that's what I have on my eyes today. Looks kind of like this. What? Uh, so this is the palette that I have on today. I have this one on the inner corner, this one on the lid, um, this one also on the lid. I have these two right here as my base colors. And then I put a little bit of uh, this duochrome uh, right under the brow. So I went ahead and used all the colors today. Like I said, I saw that it was uh, back in stock. So I thought I would go ahead and use it and um, film the glow that I got with it because I think it's a very glowy, very pretty palette. And I went ahead and used uh, the ColourPop Gel Eyeliner to go along with it. As far as my base today, use the LYS. And this one is in LN3, Light Neutral 3. And I uh, found that the finish is very glowy, and that's what I like. So it also has some good skincare benefits in it. So, uh, yeah, liking this quite a lot. And I use the, um, let's see, the Pretty Fresh Concealer by ColourPop as well. And that's what I have on under the eyes, as well as a little bit of the Beauty Pie Corrector. This is the one in light. So that's what I have on there. Went ahead and used some of the Charlotte Tilbury here. And I have the color Medium. And so this is what I have on as far as a bronzer today. So that's the color there. And yeah. And then as far as what I went ahead and did with the blush, um, this is the Golden Apricot blush, and mine has seen much better days. In fact, it's probably here kind of falling apart, but this one is from AOA. And it's baked formula. It just has a lot of glow to it and a lot of shine. And I thought, you know, to match up here that that would pretty well match, and it did. Um, went ahead and used ColourPop Seismic today as far as my highlighter. So that's what I have on there. And a little bit of the Glowish uh, powder as well. Like I said, I've had mine since February. I don't usually go through products really fast, but this one I'm going through. So as you can see, new favorite right here. Used a little bit of the Sungla Sungasm. This one's from Catrice. It's a great summer powder. And I just used it right on the cheeks today. So that's the only place that I put this. But um, yeah, I think it turned out really pretty too. And let's see, um, as far as going ahead and getting my eye products, I'll be right back. I'll be just a second here. Okay, back again. So the NYX Born to Glow on, and this is, of course, under the foundation. So I have, um, yeah, these two on the base today. So, um, and this is quite glowy. It's really, really glowy actually. And then what I have on the eyes is that I went ahead and did the NYX Thick It Stick It and Light Ash Brown. That's what I have on there. And then as far as going, oh, <laughs> yeah. And I have the Volume Stylist uh, from Essence. I also have a little bit of the NYX um, Lash Primer on as well. But as you can see, I'm using a lot of products today and things are just sort of up and left here. So um, as far as um, the lipstick, I have the Maybelline Superstay Ink Crayon. This one's in 80. 
and that's what I have on there. And then I went ahead and put a little bit of the Tower 28, and this is their gloss and cashew over the top of it. So that's how that turned out. Uh, this is how the eye look turned out. And I think that's just about my video today. Um, like I said, uh, wish me luck. I have a lot of stuff to do and I just wanted to get this look filmed because I thought it was really pretty glowy rosy look and um, yeah I was really really happy to see this palette back again because I like I think a lot of people um, do like this palette and would like this palette. It has a lot of really good colors in it and I think that's about it and uh, thank you and have a great day okay Bye.